Hello everybody, welcome back to the workshop. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make this kaiju helmet. Enjoy. So to start off this build, um, this is the drawing I drew during uh, my behind the scenes video of the uh, 1k subscriber skit. And uh, I chose Pacific Rim because it was something I normally don't do. But um, this is the kaiju, his name is Hardship. He was fighting Romeo Blue in, I think, Los Angeles of the movie. But the screen time was very limited, so it's hard to find, like, actual actions from the creature himself. But otherwise, on the filming aspect of the skate you saw, the costumes were, like, I winged it, but I also put a lot of effort into it. It's hard to explain, because each costume took only three hours. Now, that sounds like a very long or a short period of time, whichever one you think. But... I had to whip out the costumes very fast because I wanted to film during Christmas break, but I had to go on a ski trip, which turned that one week Christmas break down to one day of filming. So I had to whip out the costumes, and with the fog machine and the flashing lights on the Jaegers, which was supposed to every so often shine in the camera and discombobulate the viewer, it was supposed to make you forget that, oh, this is a zero dollar budget skit that me and my friend uh, made to celebrate 1,000 subscribers. But this video is how I made the helmet of the kaiju right here. Now, um, it's similar to how they made the Godzilla costumes. Um, for example, like his head, the man who played Godzilla, his head was in the neck portion. A uh, Mecha Godzilla is actually a good example because the, there's like a rib texture on his neck and that's clearly where he saw out of. So, cause the Godzilla is a different like build than a, the average human. So that's basically what I did with the kaiju here. Uh, my friend's head was sitting in the neck portion and then the head actual of the kaiju was on top of his own head. And when he crouched over like a monster, he would be able to see out through the mouth hole. But um, otherwise, well, this is what I'm showing you how to do today is the kaiju helmet itself. So let's start. So the way I made it was I had a big strip of cardboard for the eyes on the kaiju, and then I uh, just made angles and glued it on to, for the jaw uh, angles to open up the mouth. And uh, then with that, then I built this knife-like fin on the top of his head. So for now, I'm going to start by cutting out the eye strip. So then with this uh, strip of cardboard you have here, just bend it against the corrugation. So then you have this uh, curved headpiece, and that's where the eyes will be. Next, with your last piece, which is actually the perfect shape, do the exact same thing. Now this will be the bottom portion of the jaw. So now that you have both your pieces, it's going to be glued together like that. So when you have those two pieces glued together, feel free to make the mouth opening a little bit bigger by cutting off the excess pieces of cardboard. Then flip it over and just glue it onto a flat piece of cardboard like that. So next I added these neck pieces that go only as far as to where the jaw is. And then we're going to move on to the fin that's on the top of his head. So first, go ahead and draw the shape of the fin out onto a piece of cardboard and then just go ahead and cut it out like so. So make sure you cut out two of them and then when you put them together, it should look like this. Also make sure to fill in this big void with some more cardboard and do the same on the back. Then cut out a bunch of tiny little triangles and glue them all along the inner rim of the jaw. Now most of the back will be left open because in the skit my friend wore a gray hoodie to match the rest of the helmet here so I only need to add one strip right here of cardboard just to hold my head in place and then one where the chin is. Also, if you were wondering, this is what it's like to wear it. Your head would be sitting right about here, and then you'd be able to see throughout the mouth. So then you're gonna have to cut out two of these eye-shaped pieces of cardboard. I don't know what kind of shape I should describe them as, but save those for later. But they will be the eyes, and I'm going to paint them after I paint the rest of the helmet. Otherwise, let's go get this guy a paint job. So then just go ahead and paint these white, and then attach them right where you think the eyes should be. And then just go ahead and draw on some pupils using a Sharpie marker. And there we go. That is how you build a kaiju helmet for movie making. 
It is also made the same way they made uh, monsters for the Godzilla universe back in the 50s and 70s, where, uh, you know, you'd see out the neck or something like that, or something creative, because you put it on the neck, but you see out the mouth area. And that's how I did it with the skit. But otherwise, you would want to wear like something like a gray sweatshirt underneath with the hood on, so, you know, your head doesn't get seen or something like that. And I'm sorry about the lighting, but there's the head portion and the fin. If you're wondering how to put the helmet on, this is how it's normally done. You just slip it on from the front. And then this ring right here would rest on the back of your head. And then your visibility. It looks kind of whack because I did make it a little small. But then you would see right off the mouth.